today we got top 10 inappropriate jokes in Disney movies you missed as a kid, you know what I'm saying? Before we get into this, make sure to smash that like button and also subscribe, turn on the bell notification, or else I'm gonna run out of breath for real. Oh, what the hell? Oh, if you don't get your Welcome what? to Ms. Mojo. Bro, today, it's been five seconds. Dang. For the top 10 creepy okay, or let's log in. jokes in Disney yeah. movies. Huh. Let's see if you guys get these. For this list, we'll be looking at the most outrageous, questionable, okay. and suggestive bro, jokes intended for Personally, adults. I'm not getting stepped on like that, bro. That's just me. Studios films. Which of these moments do you think is the most inappropriate? Let right. us know in the hey, comments. Hey, y'all in the comments. Y'all in the comments. There's going to be 10 of them, so make sure uh, 1 through 10, which one is the most, like, Sus or inappropriate. Number ten. Comment Rock down below after the video's over. Tent. The Emperor's Rock new pitches groove. A tent. The Emperor's new groove is known for its kooky Yo. designs and humor, so it probably comes as no shock that it's full of naughty moments. A pretty naughty one comes when Kronk and Isma are camping out for the night. She appears okay. to have taken the larger tent, leaving him to fend for himself. <gasps> the peasant at the diner. Bro, he didn't pay his check. Ever the innovator, he has a little tent over his private parts, meaning oh. he's pitched a tent in more ways than one. Hopefully, young viewers just take this moment at face value. Bro, I ain't gonna lie, I don't even get that one. Quite the double entendre, and we're kind of impressed. It's the peasant who I mean, like, now I get it, into the crowd but as a kid, I wouldn't discovered. get that. <sighs> he must have taken him back to his village, so if we find the village, we find him, and if we find him, we find Cusco. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. Number nine. Bro, why are you talking Hercules like that? Thoughts on Oedipus. Hercules! Hercules. Bro, Wonder who else loves Hercules? All right, before we get into the sussness of Hercules. <laughs> bro, Hercules, bro, that was the movie to watch, bro. Like, as a kid, Funniest back in my day in the 1950s. The bro. Hercules was always a bit more on the wild side. From a throwaway joke about Narcissus to a sassy Hades telling Meg that Hercules is bound to disappoint her, the movie pushed Bruh. many boundaries. I can't believe you're getting so worked up about some guy. Bro, he's a <laughs> hater, bro. Bro, I hate this guy. He's such a hater. Look at it, bro. Look at it, bro, bro, bro. bro. Y'all, y'all, look, look at his face, bro. If I was built like this, I would be mad at Hercules too, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'd be, I'd be frustrated. You know what I'm saying? I'd be furious. <laughs> I mean, he would never do anything to hurt me. He's a guy. In one scene, after nah. spending the day with Meg, the titular character comments on the play they attended. That play, that, that, that Oedipus thing? Man, I thought I had problems. <laughs> Adults will know what? that he's referencing the plot of Oedipus Rex, where Oedipus accidentally Oedipus. fulfills a prophecy as he kills his father and marries his mother. Herc's problems definitely Bro, do seem why a little do less that? intense in comparison to that story. Number That's crazy. Eight. Gurgle almost swears. Finding Gurgle. Nemo. Finding Nemo? Nemo's mom and siblings being killed. And Yo, I watched that back in 1970. His son forever. Finding Nemo has some surprisingly bleak moments. It's okay, Daddy's here. Hey yo, what you mean by that? Daddy's got you. Oh, Since that's Pixar scary. films feel like they're designed for both adults and children, the filmmakers often sneak in a few gags for older audiences. That's While facts. In Dr. Sherman's tank, Nemo's friend Gurgle gets grossed out by how dirty their home has become. So he speaks up, but is abruptly cut off by Peach the starfish. Don't you yeah. people realize we are swimming in our own? Here we come. We can all oh, see the oh, about to come out of Yo, house, he was about to say we're swimming in our own caca. Shit. Don't demonetize me, YouTube. Be so foul mouthed. Yeah, we're gonna be clean. Number seven. Uh. Mia and Tia flash Lightning McQueen. Cars. We all know that Lightning, Lightning McQueen, McQueen is insanely famous and beloved. Oh, I remember to see However, when they flash him. The that he has groupies probably could have been left out of the film. <laughs> While awaiting the That's facts. Cup results, two of his fans, Tia and Mia, rush towards him. I'm Mia. I'm Tia. We're like your baby. Yeah. They profess their admiration in nah, front of multiple news cameras and proceed to if you flash know, you know. headlights at him. Based on Lightning's expression, he knows exactly what flashing means in both the human nah, world that's crazy. and the carverse. And that's he's crazy. quite content to stare at Mia and Tia's um headlights. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, no! <Number> six. <laughs> Bro knows exactly what he was looking at, but oh my god, bro, these creators are crazy, bro. They do exactly what they're Mr. doing. And Mrs. Incredibles children, the Incredibles. Syndrome is downright evil in the Incredibles, and it turns out he's downright cheeky too. After suspending bro. the Incredible family in midair, he makes quite a few comments about them. 
What's up with well? What's up with these villains in these movies? Just just being so ugly, bro. Like, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Like, bro. Imagine having a face built like this, bro. Like, bro. Bro. I, I like, I like, bro, bro. Personally, if I had a face like this, bro, it's raps. Like, I'm not even going. Namely, he pokes fun at my life is over. <laughs> and references the fact that Mr. Incredible married Elastigirl. Elastigirl? <laughs> You married Elastigirl? But his most Damn. icky observation what are you trying comes to say, bro? after he notices their kids, Violet and Dash. Oh, and got busy! It's a whole oh family my God. of supers! Syndrome, this he is said they got busy. the fact that your enemy has had children. At the very least, keep that thought to yourself. I'm oh saying, God, man. Jackpot. Oh, this is just too good. Number five. Nah, Let's these kids. excited. Boy Buzz gets excited. Two. While Woody has a clear love interest in Bo Yo. Peep, Buzz doesn't need a special lady until Toy Story 2. But boy, is he ever enamored with Jessie once she enters their lives. Ma'am, I, uh, um, <clears throat> well, I just want to say you're a bright young woman with a beautiful yarn full of hair. A hair full of yarn. It's, uh, Oh, um, <clears throat> I must go. Bro. Well, aren't you Bro. the sweetest face boy <laughs> I ever met? He can't even form a coherent sentence when they all return. Bro got home. nervous. After he got nervous, bro. After demonstrate her agility, he pops his wings, implying that he's well aroused. Oh! He popped it. This is nah, that's crazy. <laughs> nah, that's crazy, bro. Oh my God, bro. Oh my god, if you know, you know, bro. Buzz got a straight boner. <laughs> the first time Disney has referenced to what can happen to excited Yo. men either. In Bambi, a cute kiss makes all the blood in Flower's body rush through him, and he becomes rigid. Yo, he got hard too? Oh nah, he got stiff. But impossible to unsee. That's crazy, Number bro. Four, Yzma's dagger reveal, the Emperor's new groove. I what the hell is this? Happening. For such a goofy movie, the Emperor's new groove has quite a few body moments. When Cusco was this made in the 1920s? against Yzma, she seductively lifts up her skirt, causing the pair to scream in agony and beg Yzma to stop. Then I bet you weren't expecting this. <laughs> She quickly Bro, that she what has is she a doing? dagger strapped to her leg, prompting the pair to sigh in relief. Hey, <laughs> yo. They're fine with Yzma killing them, but not with her flashing them. Honestly, yeah, we don't want to see that, bro. I ain't gonna lie. If you ask us, Yzma's still got it, and she shouldn't be afraid to flaunt it. She ain't got nothing, no, bro. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> off and Anna she ain't got nothing. Foot size, frozen. Oh, I remember this. warn you about strangers? Yes, they did. Based on their conversations, yeah. it seems that Anna and Kristoff are the thirstiest couple in Disney history. That's As facts. They, they were weird in the movie. Elsa in Frozen, he bombards her with questions about Hans, whom she got engaged to after one day. When Kristoff asks Anna engaged about after one day is crazy. foot size, her reply is telling. Foot size? Foot size doesn't matter. There is a belief oh that the size my of a man's foot can indicate the length of something else, making this That's crazy. a dirty joke. Why would they this say that the in this movie? This is the only time Anna and Kristoff allude to what happens in the boudoir. In Frozen 2, when he complains about his clothing, her cheeky answer says it all. I prefer you in leather anyway. This is some serious Fifty Shades of Arendelle. Number two, huh? Dumbo Should and Timothy it? hallucinate. Dumbo. Let's see you blow a square one. Now. How do you shape his nose like that, bro? That's very, very clever. Even though Dumbo is just over an hour long, a lot happens. From Whoa. elephant mistreatment to scary clowns, this Disney classic has some of the most disturbing scenes ever put to film. One of the strangest happens Wait, what's going after on? Dumbo and his mouse pal Timothy drink far too much of the bubbly and begin oh. to hallucinate pink elephants. Seeing pink oh, elephants drunk. is actually a they're euphemism drunk. for getting so inebriated one starts to have visions. Nah, that's While that's crazy. certainly worrisome on its own, what's truly they're drunk dismaying they are the animals themselves. Can you Kids, don't do drugs, man. Their hollow don't do eyes drugs. And tell us they're not nightmare fuel. Look out! Look out! Elephants on parade. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Honorable a mentions. Potato, Monsters University. He looks Bro. like he got into the greens. It's ugly as hell. 
bears, inside out. Anger reminds us that there's more than one type of furry creature in San Francisco. What was that? Was it a bear? It's a bear. There are no bears in San Francisco. I saw a really hairy guy. He looked like a bear. Multiplication. <laughs> what? Utopia. Judy makes a quite the joke about how effectively bunnies reproduce. $200 a day, 365 days a year. Since you were 12, that's 2 days at times 20, which is 1,460,000, I think. I mean, <laughs> I am just a dumb bunny, but we are good at multiplying. Mushu's powers Whoa! Move on. Shimi reaction was probably warranted. My powers are beyond your mortal imagination. For instance, my eyes can see straight through your armor. Oh! An awkward <laughs> explanation. Bro got slept. There was a better way for Linguini to reveal Remy's existence. I have this this tiny, uh, a little, a little. Little what? A tiny chef who tells me what to do. A tiny chef. Before nah, continue, what did he mean sure by that, bro? <laughs> nah, we know what it means, but like, still, video. that still sounds sus. You have the option to be notified for okay. All right, but get on to the first, bro. Come on, man. Thieves. While the original Aladdin was a salacious comment, Aladdin and the King of Thieves. While Aladdin. the original Aladdin, Aladdin was a hit, most of us don't remember the two sequels that followed that well. Cry, yeah, I didn't watch them. So magical. I'm not gonna cry. But it turns out there were some clever gems worth tuning in for, courtesy of Genie himself. As Aladdin and Jasmine stand ready to tie the knot in the third film, there's an unexpected attack on the castle. Let me be the point man. Hey the yo! That ensues, the genie slips in this incredibly lewd one-liner. They just put it in his butt until the honeymoon. This is a pretty wait, 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 wait. What do you say? I thought the earth wasn't supposed to move until the honeymoon. This is oh, a pretty raunchy no. comment, especially for a children's film. But That's if crazy. Can pull it off? It's genie. Bro, he said. He said. I didn't know the earth. No, the earth. Wait, what do you say? wasn't supposed to move until the honeymoon the earth wasn't supposed to move to move to the honeymoon bro because like on the honeymoon you know what i'm saying uh make love and all that hey if you know you know bro if you know you know this is a pretty wrong <laughs> comment especially yo that's for crazy a film. that was literally that's, in a kid's anyone movie anyone can pull it off it's genie i guess bro. With our picks check out this yo which one one out of ten which one was the most like inappropriate what do you guys think leave it down below in the comments and i'll see you guys in the next one hey!